Hey guys, welcome back to the Planner Pixie Co. Show. Still playing catch up. Almost getting there, but we're still playing catch up. Uh, doing a little rewind memory spread. It was the week of July 5th through the 11th. This was the week that I actually finally watched the new Cru Cruella movie. So I did pull the Cruella kit from Glam Planner. Um, this is so pretty. I feel like that is Christina Aguilera. Um, this is um, a mini kit, so I purchased this quite some time ago when I was still buying mini kits, so I am unfortunately going to have to make some extra stuff, pull from the multicolor line to make enough boxes for myself, but that's okay. Um, I've got this double box here, and then the, one of the bigger boxes I did also purchase her like kit specific foil which is in red glitter so I did make myself some red glitter underlays and then I did pull a couple of these new frames that are in the red glitter. I have um, these boxes right here that I've got as freebies from SPC. I have my whole re reinforcements and then I do have some headers here too. So. I'm excited to lay this down per usual, so let's see what that looks like. We have made it to the first full week in July. Can I get closer? Yeah. I'm so excited. I am making such good progress at getting caught up. I mean, I know it's October, but anyway, if I keep this up, I'll be caught up in no time. I'll be caught up in no time. All right, let me pull out my useless workout sticker. <laughs> what is the point? I don't know. Okay, so this particular Monday, we were both in the office this day. Um, Casey was cutting, I was probably doing foil, uh, looks like we did a little packaging this day, and we completed all open orders. That is from Millie Paper Co., and I do think that was the last one of those on that sheet. I'm so sad because that's been some of my favorite couple stickers. They're very neutral, and they just go with a lot of different kits, and they're just super cute, and I guess I need to go back and see if she still has them. 
she actually doesn't really do planner stickers a lot anymore but i do think that she still has those in her shop she makes a lot of vinyl stickers these days which i really need to order some of them too because they're super cute um all right so for uh for, for, for packaging orders i pulled this bubba bear studios actually just made a purchase from bubba bear studios the other day have it purchased from her in a hot second we had Subway probably, sorry, meant to turn my phone off. We had Subway probably for lunch and dinner this night, because that's usually what happens. This is, you know, I don't know where this sticker's from. This might have been Fox and Cactus, possibly. I don't think it's Beneva Creations, or no, it might be Fox and Cactus, I don't know. I don't know on that one. Um, what do you guys get at Subway? I'm very boring and I get turkey and bacon on wheat and cheese, lettuce, pickle, onion, and that's it. And then when I get home with it, I usually put more onion and uh, usually seasonal and some spicy brown mustard. That's always pretty much what I get. I used to get like the barbecue rib that they had um, that was forever ago, and the last time that they came back with them, I got one. I was like, gross. Why Why was I so obsessed with these back in the day? Because I really did not like it. Um, maybe a year or so ago they came back out with them. I don't know. I really didn't like it then. Anyway, I did some plan with me prep this night. I just love this little sticker, the overhead view. I wish you would just do a whole sheet of those. That is from Once More With Love. What did I prep? I prepped the Tink um spread from spc you know i really been thinking about before that um kit is gone going back and ordering another one because i really want to do 52 weeks of disney eventually and i really would like that to be a part of it so you might be seeing that in a haul shortly um that is from once more with love as well and i just had a little design session to finish my night per usual and then on tuesday you know I put two boxes here because I had literally wrote down three things for the day. Uh, well, there was a couple more things, but those I put in my monthly view. It's like, you know what? I'm just going to fill it with two, two boxes. Who's to say that you can't put two boxes in the same day? I mean, it's my planner. Do with it what you will. So I thought instead of trying to just make stuff up or using all these big boxes that I just used two of the pretty boxes. So that's what I did um I designed all day this day that's why it was a super boring day that is from stick with the plan co and I am using some of these little sparkly boxes I think that's from hmm, I think those are scribble prints co I really don't like making those like I have some of the sparkly boxes that I've made but I have to do it on like the like super expensive I guess like unicorn paper and it rolls up so bad it's just it's not even worth it it's so annoying like you have to put it under a ton of books or something to get it to flatten out before you can even cut it it's just whatever <laughs> I'll just keep buying them from SPC. Um, we had a PO drop this day. That is an extremely ancient dinosaur old icon from our shop. That's some of the first things that I come out with in my shop. Um, and we had salads this night. That is from Starfish and Frog. Okay, on to Wednesday, I had an attack of my allergies this day. It's just been so rough this summer. I don't know what it is about this summer. I think I've probably talked about it in previous plan with me's. My allergies have been awful. And honestly, I'm not allergic to anything. So I don't know what is causing me to be this stopped up all the time. But it started this year, the very first day that we went to the lake. And I mean, I know the lake is like disgusting and full of disgusting things so I'm sure that's what started it but I don't know why it keeps getting aggravated anyway I had a pretty bad allergy attack this day that is from once more with love and then I also did not sleep from the night before that's from oh hello Michelle wow this was a wonderful day for me team no sleep and then I also got my period this day 
Um, yeah, feeling fine this day. This is from Stick with the Plan Co. I think these are so stinking cute and just funny. So I just put Ant Flo and then I edited and uploaded. What are we on Wednesday? Let's see. Edited and uploaded Dreamer. That seems like so long ago, and I'm sure it was only a few spreads back. And I also did some plan with me prep. Get all my boxes down. So edited and uploaded a video. This is from Paper Shire. I'm gonna cut it a little bit because I just like doing that. I think it looks cute when you cut the bottom off and it's super straight. Um, edit and upload. Guys, I swear I'm going to do a video on script soon. I'm focused on getting caught up. And then I'm going to do the video on scripts. I've already sat down and made a whole page of notes as to what I need to include in it so that I don't miss anything. But I promise, promise, promise it's coming. I feel like I have a pretty good hack. And I don't know, maybe you guys have seen it already before. As to help make scripts, it makes it a whole lot quicker. I used to really dread doing scripts and now it's not so bad. This is from Once More With Love, Plan With Me Prep. I prepped the Her Day, which was Mother's Day week. And then had a little design session in bed the rest of the night. That is from Once More With Love. Is that all it says? It says design and binge. I don't know what I binged. It does not say. On to Thursday. We, let's see. I still was having some bad allergy issues this day. I think I may have to cut one of these because this is a little bit bigger than what I'm used to. I'll put it up a little bit. This spread glitter just looks really good with this spread. We'll go ahead and stick this one down here and then I'm possibly might have to cut the middle one, we'll see. Nope, it works. Cool. All right, so still having allergy issues this day. This is also on that same sheet from Once More With Love, but it's a little bit different. So I just put, because uh, that's how I felt. And we had lunch with um, Casey's uncle and aunt this day. He had been wanting us to go eat lunch with him. We were supposed to actually go to a different place, but that place was closed that day. So we went across the street. I can't remember what that restaurant's called at the moment. So just put lunch with Bud and Sandy, and that is from Every Minute of Story. I love those. Really wish you would put a whole sheet of those. This is an icon from our shop, and I come home and did the checkbook this day. Ooh, I need to do that now. I've been doing so much better. I keep it up with my checkbook. I just feel like I've been really on it, trying to get things caught up lately. I'm proud of myself. Um, let's see. I'll go ahead and stick this one down here. I had to order groceries, which is probably why I did. Ooh, I may have to cut. Really? Maybe I don't have to cut that one. I usually do the checkbook when I order groceries. Yeah, why is that so much bigger than like, is that bigger than like a normal? I just screwed that all up. Did you see that? Ooh, I just messed that up. Can you see? Hmm, I don't like that. Let me see if I've got another one. Uh, where would I have put those? I don't even know. Maybe there, I found it. Shoot, that is not something that I want to mess up very often. Foil, no ma'am. Okay, anyway, I'm going to cut this one in half to get it to fit. Does that not like a normal 
half box size. Do I have a half box anywhere? Let me see. It is. So I wonder why that doesn't fit. I'm confused. Oh, because I don't usually try to fit two of those in that. Okay. Okay. I see what I did there. I see what I did. Um, okay. So anyway, <laughs> squirrel. Normally when I order groceries and have to order like a bunch of supplies and stuff, I do the checkbook just to make sure and see where we're at as to not spin too much. Okay. Here we go. Let's put this one in here. We'll put it a little bit closer than usual. And then we'll just stack these on top of each other. And that'll be fine. There we go. That works. Sticker surgery to save the day. Okay. I wonder why I have those on the same side. Something's going to happen that's going to piss me off, I'm sure. That looks crooked to me. Maybe a little. It's okay. Okay. So I had to order groceries. This is from Once More With Love. And then I also had to order supplies. Um, which, I'm going to be honest, I hate ordering supplies. <laughs> it's a lot. Paper costs so much. It's the paper that costs so much. Like, I dread ordering paper every time I order paper. <laughs> That is from Coffee Monsters Co. And then I just finished the night designing the rest of the evening. This is from Stick With The Plan Co. I just love that sticker. Like the detail with like the little light shining. So cute. Design sesh. Alright, for Friday. Had to push releases this week for some reason. I don't know. This might have been around the time that some other things were happening. I don't know. I guess we'll come to that in future weeks. That is from Bubba Bear Studios. Push releases. I hate pushing releases. So see, this is usually I use a half box in one of these, not two of those other ones. That's why I got screwed up and I don't even know why I tried to do that. Um, I had to pick up my groceries that I had ordered the night before. This is from Sweet Ava's Paper. And I had to pick up between three and four. The last few times, I may have already told you guys this, but I don't remember. The last few times I have did grocery pickup, like I was supposed to pick up at four was the latest, they texted me and said, we're sorry, but your groceries have been delayed. Please pick them up between five to six. It's just like, are you kidding me? Like, I legit was getting in the car to go get them one day and got that text. I guess I'm glad I wasn't already halfway there. But anyway, it's kind of annoying. Um, then I had to come home and work on new releases so I could get them published for Saturday. That is an icon from our shop. Just put new releases, and we had pizza this night. That is from Bubba Bear Studio. And, um, oh, we watched the Fear Street Part 2 this night. Was it the last plan with me? I just filmed that, so I can't even remember. Yeah, so the last one that I just filmed, we watched Part 1. It was my favorite one, but the all of them were good, honestly. That is from Fox and Cactus, and I just thought it would be cute to use it because it was kind of like... I don't really think it was scary, really, but it, you know, it was supposed to be a scary, creepy movie. Um, Alright, on to Saturday. We did have new releases this day, so first things first. I had to publish the sale. I feel like I'm about to sneeze. Excuse me. All right, this is from Sweet Beans Plans. So publish sale. And then, oh man, I really hope my allergies aren't starting up again. Then we were both in office this day. This is from Coffee Monsters Co. It's getting hot in here too. I have to go turn the air down. 
Um, yeah, so this was the day that I actually watched Cruella, so I went ahead and put her on this day. I thought that that, you know, would be fun to put her there on this day. Cruella Aguilera. I swear that's Christina Aguilera. Casey doesn't think it looks like her, but I do. What do you guys think? It's, it's her, right? Cruella Aguilera. All right, then I had to do a laundry this day. I really had a hard time finding a laundry sticker to match the spread, but I did it, kinda. That is from Happy Daya. And then we had steak salads this night. Oh, yummy. I love salads, I do. I love a good salad. So good. That's two we had this week, wasn't it? Yeah, I just used the same sticker from uh, Starfish and Frog because it's really the only salad sticker I had that halfway matched. And then I just put Movie Night Cruella, and I used the little Cruella. I think this is, I don't know if it's Once More With Love or Coffee Monsters Co. It's one or the other. So I just put Movie Night Cruella. All right, so to finish out our week, ooh, crap. I halfway messed up another sticker. Dang it. Um, Casey was cutting this day. This is from Starfish and Frog, I think. It's just a little portrait silhouette. God. Yeah, I stuck it to another sticker and now it's not very sticky underneath. I may have to pull another one. Ooh, I am burning up. Which way did I have that? Maybe it'll stay. All right, Casey cutting this day. And it looks like I just designed all day, which is what I'm about to go do now. Hairs everywhere. Can you tell that I messed that up? A little bit, not as bad as that other one though. All right, this is from Stick With The Plan Co. That's pretty much what I look like on the couch all day. And then, I'm probably going to pull an arrow off camera. Let's see. Had to do some more laundry this day. Why did I pull? Let's switch these. Pulled the same color to go by each other. I don't like that look. Okay. Uh, this is from Sparkly Paper Co. It's so tiny. It's like the tiniest little bear. I feel like I hear Casey outside. I was home alone, but I might not be home alone now. I don't know. Laundry, and then we had potato soup this night. Yum, in my time. I think we had potato soup last week, too. It is soup weather, you guys, and I am here for it. That is from Once More With Love. And then, because I watched Cruella the night before, I just went ahead and watched the original 101 Dalmatians this night. This is an icon from our shop. You know, 101 Dalmatians is never really like one of my favorites as a kid. I really liked Cinderella and The Little Mermaid. I was really into like princessy stuff. Um, so I'm not, I mean, I'm sure I've watched 101 Dalmatians, but I'm not sure I had even watched it since I was like a little tiny kid. So I didn't remember much about it. And I don't know where I thought all the, the dogs come from. I guess I thought that one dog had 101, or had 100, a bunch of puppies. Nine, that would have been 99 puppies, right? That's not how it went at all, but <laughs> I figured that out watching the movie again. I'm a big dum dum. I really do like the way this one turned out. I mean, I feel like I say that for every one of them. Is there ever a spread that you did and you're just like, oh God, I hate this? I'm not sure I've ever done that before, other than the ones that I used to write in. But ever since I've been making script, I don't think I've had a spread yet that I'm like, I hate this. So <laughs> anyway, I think the red glitter looks really good. I'm glad I used some of the boxes. And I don't think that looks bad at all. Do you guys like with just one little box? I like it. I should do that more often. I'm glad there was enough boxes to do it for this spread. So Hopefully you guys like this video. If you did, please give it a big thumbs up. Like and subscribe. Do all the things so you don't miss all the things. And I'll talk to you guys soon. Bye, guys.